This fucking kid. Hey, hey, hey! Your uncle doesn't have time for that bullshit today. Uncle Z, Zane. Hey, whoa. Show some respect. Mr. Z. Out from under the rock, I see. Yo, man, I I'm gonna have your money. I, I know I owe you. I, I just need- When will you have my money? Uh, tomorrow. Yo, tomorrow, I'll have it, I, I swear. You'll have it tomorrow, I swear. Yo, I swear. On my mom's grave. Your mom? Swear to me. Uncle Z. I, Mr. Z. I swear I'll have it tomorrow. Very good. Listen, Daniel. I told your mother I'd always look out for you. But my patience is starting to wear thin. Hey, junk man. Motherfucker. What is it, Christmas already? What is he doing? Search him. What you want us to do? I want the two of you to stop talking so I can think. What are you gonna do with this? Hit him with it? How fun. Stupid motherfucker. Jack. Look, Jack, I know it's unfortunate what happened. Cut the shit, Zane. You made the call. That's right. I do make the call. And if I remember correctly, I think I called you first. I asked you to clean up that thing with Ramon in Miami. Fuck Ramon, Zane. You and I both knew how that was going to go down. Look, I know you're upset. Oh! Part of someone, Zane? A part of someone? Yes. A part. Being so connected to someone that you forget where they end and you begin? No, Jack. I can't say that I have. There's a tribe in South America called the Yanomami, or Yanom. There are people known for their violent ways but yet maintain an honorable culture. They keep a strong sense of family and community and claim that when a loved one dies, the body must be burned until all that remains is ash and bone. The only way to save the soul is by having family members consume the ashes. Delightful. The Yanam then mix the ash with bananas into a mush and have all family members gather round. 
They believe this ceremony allows the soul of the deceased passage into salvation, and that only by the act of physically putting that ash inside them will the soul of their loved one be saved. Today, Zane, I'm here to salvage the souls of mine. The bullets in this gun are led from the ashes of my family. The family you took from me. You ordered the hit that killed your own daughter. My wife. And for what? They weren't supposed to be there. And Megan? It was just supposed to be you, Jack. She was only six years old. Your own granddaughter! That's right, Jack. She was my only granddaughter.